Well, hello, you two. We haven't seen you in a few days. We've got Raisin up here. I just gave the hamsters brand new greens to eat. Uh, healthy cabbage uh, and a few other veggies that are chopped up. Gave them that, and of course, Raisin immediately ran up because she is the the gluttonous one of the two. She is the one that is, is uh, losing some weight because for a few days straight last week we gave them fruit and apparently Raisin ate the fruit like way too much, you know, like probably ate twice as much as Cinnamon did and Cinnamon was, you know, more laid back and she ate all the fruit that Cinnamon didn't eat and ended up gaining some weight. Isn't that right, Cinnamon? Yes, I did not eat, but she did. So she actually gained some weight and uh, now she's on a diet. We haven't given them fruit in a few days. We're trying to give them more healthier snacks like millet and now veggies for a few days and hopefully this will help them to slim down, will help her to slim down. Oh, Cinnamon's trying to go up the tube. Both hamsters now have found ways to get up. As you can see, Cinnamon is trying to climb right now. No, she's giving up. She oh, tries and she reason. gives up. Oh. She'll get up there later. Cinnamon has been on the top just like, uh, just like Raisin. So Raisin immediately went up there to get the fresh veggies. And sat in the bowl. Couldn't eat out yeah, of the bowl. Yeah, sits in the bowl. In that's, that's the problem with hamsters is they tend to do that. They tend to sit in their food and then they unfortunately they defecate in their food. And that's what you need to do is you need to be cleaning the food dish uh, constantly and making sure there's either a fresh layer on top or that you completely clean out the food dish every day or two and make sure that it's clean because they will poop where they eat and then end up, you know, rolling around in it which is not good for them. I'll change your water guys. It's an important hamster care tip for anyone out there who may want to have hamsters one day. There's cinnamon down the tube. So that's a quick hamster update. <laughs> Both of them are now on all three floors. They've gotten to the top. As you, if you've been following Leanne on Twitter, she took a picture the other day. This morning I walked, I walked in here and, sit, and Raisin was laying in here sleeping in this tube. So it's pretty cool that they're after, you know, almost three weeks now. No, it's been two, a little over two weeks. Mm -hmm. A little, took them only about two weeks, but they're utilizing the entire cage, you know, that we bought them such a nice one. I was really hoping they would, and they are. It was fun yesterday. I didn't get to, to, to film it because we were so busy and we were running late. But when I cleaned the cage, I cleaned the whole cage out and we actually multi-level put treats. We put some yogurt drops up here so they would have to get the exercise to get to the top. We put millet on like the, th the top floor and then we put their regular food on the bottom. So they went in, they ate some of the food, went up and every level there was like a new thing for them to do, which was pretty cool. That's why I like the multi-level uh, house. All right, Raisin, we'll see you later. You're not paying no attention to me. You're deep in, in, uh, in meal time there with the, uh, the veggies. Ha, ha, ha.